Hey, what's up, everybody? How the hell are you? Uh, comedian Robert Urie here. What's going on? How you doing? Holy shit, it's... Oh, oh, yeah. I swear. These are called rants. And I swear. So what's going on, huh? Growing a hair in here a little bit. Wow, a little wacky, huh? A little crazy. I don't know what to do, man. You know, I don't know if, uh... If this is the new look. See what the fuck is going on? See, I swear. Sorry. The fuck is going on here? I, I get the spike back. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hey, what's going on? Uh, I've done a rant in a little while. Okay, I'm gonna do something that kind of pisses me off here. You ready? Uh, like I said, I swear, so you can hear some f words and some fucking f words. I don't know what to say. Um, <laughs> you guys all sick of this COVID bullshit or what? Um, like I said, I'm from New York, I'm upstate New York. Um, if that fucking means anything, but yeah, you know, our, our governor. Is a dick. Uh, the governor of New York puts the dick in dictator and... I don't know. He just puts the D in dick. Um, the reason I say that is uh, I'm watching the news, you know, and it's like, uh, you know, everybody who's really been suffering from this fucking shit is like the small businesses, you know, mom-pop stuff, you know, bars, restaurants, all this and that shit. You know, this motherfucker, he's... He's fining now, you know, he, he's fucking fining small businesses, you know, like, oh... I said you could eat outside. You know, these small businesses had to actually close the fuck down. You can't go in, whatever. You know, the, the rules change every fucking day. I'm not a small business owner, and I feel very bad for you guys watching this that are small business owners. He changes the rules every fucking day. I don't know what state you guys are from, but that's how it is in New York. You know, one minute, you know, the places can be open. The next day, they can't. Uh, oh, you can dine outside, but you can't drink. Um... This motherfucker, he's, uh... And I say he because this is the asshole who fucking set this shit up in New York, you know? Um, he's finding the living shit out of these fucking restaurants and these bars. Um, he's taking liquor licenses away. It's like, what a cocksucker, you know? What a dickhead, you know? Oh, you, me, where's my, where's my Rona mask? My Corona mask. I, I call it a fucking Rona mask. It's in the truck. It's in my truck. Um, yeah, oh, you can wear your fucking Rona mask, and you can go to fucking Hannaford, uh, Price Chopper, uh, line up at fucking Lowe's and buy some 2 by 4s um, go to Walmart, any fucking place you want to, and spend all your fucking hard-earned fucking money, okay? And some of these stores don't even give you cash back, or they don't even give you fucking change. Get the fuck out of here, you know? This thing is real, and I understand how they get it, but it's also the biggest fucking bullshit fucking scam bunch of shit we've ever seen in our lives, okay? And if you don't believe me, you're a fucking idiot, okay? Because I know anybody watching this has a fucking brain knows this is there's a whole bunch of bullshit behind all this. It's It involves the election. It's trying to get Trump out of the fucking office. Yes, you heard me. I am a Trump supporter, okay? Very proud to say it, too. Um, you know, it's, ever since this man has come into office, everything under the fucking sun has been thrown at this guy, you know? We've had some real piece of shits in the office. And you know what? I don't believe everything that this guy does is right or what he says. I know he's a little off the rocker sometimes, but I love him. You know why I love the guy? Because he loves our flag. He loves our military. He loves the police. And I'm all fucking all for the police. I'm all for the military. And I'm all for the American flag, for Christ's sakes, okay? And, uh, yeah, that's, that's one of the biggest reasons... Uh, why I support this man and why I voted for him. You know, the guy is the ultimate fucking game changer, dude. You know, anybody who sits there, he reminds me of a comedian. He reminds me of me if I was doing comedy. And if you were a fucking asshole in the audience and you started speaking up loud, I'd say, I, I'm spitting. <laughs> I would say the same thing. I'd be like, get him out of here. Get him the fuck out of here. Hey, asshole, get the fuck out of here. Get out of my show, fucker. You know, I mean, I don't know. That's why I respect the guy. That's one of the biggest things that, uh, I don't know how it turned to Trump, but. You know what I mean? I'm just saying, this whole thing's a fucking conspiracy. It's just a bunch of shit. Big believer in that. Sorry. But, uh, I like to go back to where I started about this. Yeah, our governor's an asshole. You know, you want to find the shit out of these small businesses. What a dick. What a dickhead. If you're watching this, you're a fucking dickhead. You know? The governor. Not you awesome people watching my rant. <laughs> but do you agree with me on that, though? You know, like I said, you can spend all your fucking money at Walmart... You know, you could do that. Oh, you, what, what is it? You can't go to church, you know, and all the social distancing shit. Even that's fucking nuts. 
you know, people are like getting into like almost fucking fist fights over the mask, the no mask. It, it's just a bunch of shit, man. And uh, customer service, I gotta say this one too. If you're in the customer service field, okay, I feel sorry for you, cause uh, ever since this shit happened too, customer service, I, which no offense, I always thought it was fucking minus ten stars out of ten stars. Pfft, it sucks. And there's good customer service people. There's there's some good people when you go to a store, man. But there's a lot of assholes. And uh, I don't know. It's almost uh, <laughs> preventing people, preventing me from punching people in the face sometimes. You know what I mean? Oh, just a joke. Give me thirty of a mask, and a fist. <laughs> a bad. Sorry. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know, man. Support local businesses. Um, I don't know. I just, I can't wait for this bullshit to be over with, but, uh, yeah, I just, just watching the news, and I, I know this, our, our, our governor, he wants to be president so bad, he's one of them assholes, and I, and I know that's what it is, and, and I hope he never becomes one, because I think he's a dickhead. Never met him, but I know people who know him, I'm not gonna say your name, don't worry, and I know people that have met him, and they say he's a douchebag, so, Governor Douchebag in New York, uh, fuck off, um, you'll never be president, and, uh, I don't know, I don't know what to tell you. Uh, <laughs> wow, where's this one going? <sighs> it's fucking hot out. It's fucking 80-something degrees here in Crime for New York. <laughs> crime for New York, you like that? Um, yeah. Anyways, that's it. That's it. Support your local business, and, um, yeah, come over to this bullshit to get over with. It's a fucking rant. Weird rant. I don't know, I haven't done a rant in a while. I fucking know what's up with this hair. <laughs> Sorry. The mini L. Alright, peace, love, happiness. Tell somebody a fucking joke today, god damn it. Look, it's one of the fucking Punisher shirts, man. Punisher. My neck my necklaces, my new necklaces. You like these, man? These neck crosses. Pretty cool, right? I love man. Go with the ring. Well. Huh? Celtic warrior ring. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Why is knuckles like that and a hand like that? I mean, you work your ass off? Pretty much. I don't know. All right. Talk to you later, comedian Robert Erie. Peace.